Thank you for that. Well, you can't put a price tag on safety, but the city of Northport will spend over half a million dollars to repair a cracked levee. That's one of the decisions Northport City Council made at their meeting this evening. WVUA 23's Madison McLean was there. Madison. Jack, Northport city leaders approve funding for the levy and a beautification project that Mayor Donna Aaron says is long overdue. Northport City Council approved the preliminary engineering for the MLK beautification project, an $8 million project designed to improve transportation and safety. Mayor Donna Aaron says it's about time. We, when I was on the council in the 90s, we got that grant in 98 and it has laid dormant for all these years and it is high time that got started. An additional $50,000 was approved to complete the repair of the cracked Northport levee. At completion, the repair is expected to cost $600,000, an expense that Council President Jay Logan says the taxpayers nor the city should be responsible for. City Steel is going to be on the hook for it, which I totally disagree. I feel like taxpayers have gotten the short end of the stick regarding it. Uh, we're at right at $600,000 that we've paid uh, to repair the levy that was not at fault at all from the city of Northport. Logan says despite the hefty fee, the city vows to make safety a priority. There again, we won't play chicken with safety, health and safety in that area again. And city council got heated when one Northport citizen disputed the council's decision to not provide funding to replace his grass supposedly destroyed by flooding. The council says it is illegal to use public money on private property and denied the request. The city plans to begin the engineering for MLK as soon as possible and hopes to have the levy repaired by May at the latest. Reporting live in the newsroom, Madison McLean, WVUA 23 News.